Hello! I'm the agent! You're going to be a star! Believe it! Wow! You're not going to believe what we have in store for you! <laughs> One lucky contestant is going to win a mystery prize! What is it, I hear you cry? Well, I can tell you, it's a mystery! You must have a special talent! Something spectacular! Sign up now! You're going to be a star! Who are you? Where are you from? And what do you do? Alright, Debat, how you doing? My name's Dave Dangerous. And my talent is playing with knives. Oh. Alright, maybe we'll do that. We'll do it again. Oh. Right, and then there. Uh, oh, right. So, yeah, I'm from Wales, in case you haven't guessed. And my talent is knives. Well, that is a very good question, actually, because I don't actually know myself. But I am Tony, Tony the Clown. My name is Tony Newton. I am a beat poet, clown comedian. That is who I am. My name is Laverne Lorraine. I'm originally from California. And I am a cat telepath, by which I mean I can read cats' minds. I am Christine, and I am from the South, and my special talent is that I know everything. My name's Vanessa, I'm a beautician from Bournemouth, and my special talent is competitive whistling. I've been whistling since I was six years old. Um, I'm Rusty, um, I'm 30. Birmingham, uh, and I'm the heaviest of metal guitarists of, of all time, uh, and singers, and uh, I don't really take shit, and I write cracking songs. Hello, my name is Ian Grayson, and I am an expert reader. Hi guys, hi! So I'm Stacey, I'm from London and I'm a hairdresser, but I really want to be a dancer. Sorry, I'm talking really quick, but I just, I'm just so excited right now to show you what I've been doing. I'm Declan Keefe, from the Isle of Barra in Scotland, obviously, and my job is an official baby name consultant. Hey, Steve Butterson, the movie aficionado. I know pretty much all there is to know about movies. I'm one of those kind of people out there that, you know, uh, you're not going to stump me. You're not going to trick me. There's nothing I have not seen. There's nothing I don't know about movies. Yo, I'm Dr. Crunch. I, I'm a rapper. Freestyle. Freestyle rapper. Hello, Internet. I'm Casey Balls, and I'm going to win the You're Going to Be a Star competition. I'm Crotch End's number one ABBA tribute act, and I'm going to win with my rendition of Dancing Queen. Which is going to knock you all dead. My name is Nikolai Kuznetsov. I am from St. Petersburg, Russia. Now I live in London, UK. 
I am the sexiest dancer in all of Russia. But soon my talents will be worldwide. What, what didn't you remind me? I can't remember everything. Uh, I'm, I'm Nigel. Um, this, this was going to be my talent. But, uh, it's broken, isn't it? I can't remember everything. Hey, mate. I'm going to be a star. I've got a backup. It's not as good, is it? What do you think the mystery prize is? Mm? I really hope the mystery prize is a cruise for three. Because I have two beautiful wives who deserve a holiday. The prize? You mean my prize? My prize will be what I bloody well want it to be. That's the truth. They'll say, oh, you won. Congratulations. Right, now, what do you want? Hey, laddie. Well, I want to go to hell. Michigan. Hell. You know, the USA. Gotta love to go to hell. Well, I was... I'm hoping for like a, like a, a holiday. A holiday would be nice. For one! On my own! Yeah. Or a shed. Shed would be nice, wouldn't it? Shed for one! Biscuits, no, no. Stop thinking about that, Dr. Crunch. Stop thinking about it. I'd like a boat. I think I know. Been for all day. I'm gonna have to get in up to this place. Um. I don't know what the special prize is, but I hope it's a trip to Bora Bora. The prize is. Hmm, must be a trip to the moon. What else? Well, I'm hoping the mystery prize is themed to the specific person. Because, you know, I hate these prize things where it's these stupid things like, oh, you want a washer dryer, and you want a refrigerator, and you want a trip to the Bahamas. I, I, I don't give a fuck about that. I, I would like the mystery prize to be for me a whole slew of movies. You know, I know I've got a lot of movies. I, I'm in a room full of movies. But I, I would like more movies. So I'm hoping the mystery prize is maybe like a super rare movie. Maybe like uh, the day the clown the day the clown cried on a bootleg DVD, or you know, so something rare, something rare movie wise. Maybe a very rare prop. Maybe Wonder Woman's underwear. You know, so something like that. Something very interesting and themed to the particular person. Because if, if you're gonna try and give me a washer dryer, you can fucking keep that shit. I don't want that. So don't bother trying to give me crap like that. I don't need that. I have no interest in that. So I would love the mystery prize to be a place at a dance school. That would be my dream. That would be the ultimate dream. Well, uh, I was hoping it was a record deal. Um, well, it better be anyway. Well. I'm not sure, but Tittle's here. He hates that name, by the way. He wants me to call him Fred. Thinks it's probably a lot of money. I think the prize is something to do with telly, it's gotta be. Because everyone wants to be famous, everyone wants to be a star. Everyone wants to be something. Everyone wants to be famous for 15 minutes or more. Everyone wants to be a YouTube star, a celebrity. So I think this is it. I do as well. It's in our nature, it's who we are. We all want money, we want fame, we want power. So I think the prize is to be on telly in a TV show, hopefully with your production company. I believe a mystery prize to be money and all that. Duh. Wow, I like vouchers, particularly 50% off. Sometimes 75 seems a bit too unfair, but 50% a nice 50% vouchers, maybe for some socks. Something like that. I'm looking to receive a rusty trombone on the high seas. Why do you think you deserve the mystery prize? Because it's fucking me. Because I'm me. 
because I'm Tony the fucking beat poet clown. I'm original. Well, no one else is going to put their life on the line like that, are they? Dangerous, you see? Die dangerous by name, die dangerous by talent. I study really, really hard and all my exams I pass with distinction. Well, because I am the most talented and the most talented should win prize. I really, really deserve this because I've been working so hard and I just, I know I'm not the best dancer, but I really, really want to try and it literally would be my dream. So oh, I'm just excited. I just, I just really, really want this, to, this dream to come true. So please, please let it happen. Now I think a mystery prize was made for me. That's what I bloody well think. I think that someone out there knew about me and knew that I'd be interested in this kind of thing. You know, they do their research and they'd say, all right, that's the lad we want. That's the one that we should get. All right, so it's intriguing with a mystery prize. I think you'll know exactly what that is. And I bloody well do, man. I know exactly what it is and I deserve it out bloody right. Oh, I mean, I deserve this because the whole thing is so-called, you know, you think you can be a star, and I am a star, so I already have that thing covered. So I definitely think that I deserve it because I think I'm also very talented at what I do, movie-related, movie knowledge. I'm just so precise with my reading that it's rather special, and I feel I should be rewarded for it. Well, uh, I don't deserve to win any more than anybody else that's joined this bloody thing. But uh, I want to prove to my, my uncle, the old man, that uh, I deserve this and uh, I've earned, I've earned this. Do you know, do you know what I mean? Because I know the struggle, yeah? I got the struggle in me. Yeah, seven years I was addicted. And now I've left that lifestyle behind. And I keep this as a reminder that I can say no to these biscuits. No! Biscuits! I deserve this because I am the best at what I do. And because, sadly, our family dog died six years ago and our family could really do with a break. Well, I think I should win the mystery prize because I've had nothing but bad luck in my life. My little brother died, my dad died, they were very young. My nan died, and then my best friend, my little dog, he died too. And I think it's the time I had some good luck in my life. Sorry. Sorry. It's only as well I deserve it, innit? Well, I'll put up with. It's dreadful. It's obvious why I deserve to win. I should be a star. I deserve this prize because I have had a difficult life. When I was three years old, my mother died. My father ran off to become a circus clown. And I became the sole carer for my grandmother, who had been left embittered by a bad facelift. She died 15 years ago, but I still miss her. Showcase your talent. I hope you are ready. For what is to come. So I'm going to show you now my dance routine that I've been working on. So... Da 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 da
It might not sound exactly like my voice right now, but I hope it gives a bit more emphasis when I'm reading. Now, I found a particular piece by Shakespeare, so there was no copyright problems with it. And here it is. My talent, my talent is reviewing movies, uh, I think, and, and having movie knowledge, but I also think I can do some really interesting voices and some crazy kind of like um, voices, and maybe I can review movies with funny voices. I have to get ready for this, okay. Okay, so actually I'm a comedian beat poet clown, so I'm gonna do some beat poetry for you first of all. Okay, give me a subject. You know, you've normally, well, this isn't gonna work, is it? Normally I get the audience to say to me, you know, a word, it could be apocalypse. So then I'll come into something like this. I come down from the apocalypse. You know me, double O F two two three. Yes, that's the apocalypse, the number, the magic. Oh yes, you see it, it's tragic. Because I'm a beat poet clown, I do what I like. I ride a bike, you know the type you like. I'm a beat poet clown, to the left, to the right. I take no numbers, I'm a prisoner. I'm a gangster with a monster inside my head because I don't like that because I want to go to bed. I end up dead if I take too many tablets, but I don't take that because my doctor told me not to. He don't like me. He told me I'm a little bike. He said, that's a tricycle. That's a kid's bike, gangster G. You know, that's not me. That's not my talent. That's just, uh, that's just an extra, that part, you know. So my magical talent is this, I can move my ears. Have you got any music here? I need some like beats and maracas. Okay, can you see this? Are they moving? Okay, left one on its own. Right one on its own. What's that, do you hear? I can hear something. Okay, here we go again, can you see this? Both together. Left one. <laughs> Right one. Alright. You are gonna be a star. Huh, huh. Here we go. Yo, yo. Yeah, I'm gonna go so far. Flow to blow you out the water. And if you hold me back, yeah, I'll run out your whole pack like custard creams. Ah. Uh. Shit. No! Oh! Oh! You know, I've been doing all kinds of things with my time, and I'm not so sure what to do, you know what I mean? I'm, like, walking around the world and, you know, reviewing movies and experiencing things and living my life to the first. I'm seeking the light, that's why I write rhyme, gives me a lifeline, like it's crunch time, I ain't no rookie, so sit down and shut up or crumble like a cookie! Oh. When forty winters shall besiege thy brow, and dig deep trenches in thy beauty's field. Thy youth's proud livery, so gazed on now, will be a tattered weed of small worth held. <laughs> then being asked where all the beauty lies, where all the treasures of thy life's days. To sigh within thine own deep sunken eyes, when all eaten shame and fifeless praise 
How much more praise deserves thy beauty's use? If thou couldst answer this fair child of mine, Shall sum up my count and make my old excuse. Proving his beauty by succession fine, This might be new made when thou art, And see thy blood warm when thou feelst it cold. As you can see, that is deserving of a prize. Well, I never did see him coming down that parkway while he was walking. I was scared, and then I smelled a strange smell, and I believe that person out there broke wind. The doctor's in the house gonna make the final cut. I'll crunch the competition like a flipping ginger nut. <laughs> Here we go then, and the talent is, if anyone's seen Alien, a bit like that, you see, when you do. Oh. Don't know how I can go, but you'll have a look. Did you see that? See, that's why I deserve to win. I can drink this half a jar of water in one go. <clears throat> Ready? <laughs> Tittles? What would you like to tell me? Really? That's a bit rude. He says the woman next door smells like a dog. And he might bring me a mouse later, if I'm good. Matt Allen, drum roll please. Oh, 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 yeah. <laughs> so, uh, when I was a nipper, my, uh, my uncle used to call me the metal detector. And it was, uh, it's because I could detect metal from, for miles away. Um, great times, but uh, a similar no relation to what this song is about. Um, I just thought I'd give you a bit of an insight. So uh, here goes. Hunt you down, kill you down, run away in this day. Kill you now, I'm so proud you're dead to me. You never see me filled with pain and woe. But you never see me when I am killing you. Oh, yeah! My goodness! You never see me filled with pain and woe. But you never see me when I am killing you. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, that's me done then. I told you it was pretty righteous.
Only the greatest and the bravest will be able to complete all the challenges. Are you ready? Brace yourselves. Five, four, three, two, one. How many cats are in this video? Oh, uh, I was, I was distracted, yo. I, I did not, I did not watch the video. There are four biscuits on that plate, though. I can't see any cats at all. Is this for a laugh? I want to speak to the manager. This isn't on. How many cats are in the video? Well, it's obvious because there's two different cats. There's one cat there at the bottom, one at the top. And you've basically got, you know, those kaleidoscopes you used to have as a kid and you spin it round and you see something crazy. Yeah, so it's that. There's two cats in that video. So am I going to win this shit or what? This is most peculiar video of Koshka. But the answer is two. Five. No, three. No, there's two cats. Two. Two cats. The question is very, very, very easy. And there are two cats in this video. How many cats? I'm glad I didn't ask how many is in this video. The bloody RSPCA will be on me. Whoa, well, uh, looks like two to me. Two? I reckon... Well, one of them's black and white. The other is... Happy two. Well, probably, probably two. But you've done all that weird shit to him. I'm not a fan of cats, but I'd have to say, by logical reasoning. That image was multiplied over multiple layers to confuse you. Now you only see two breeds of cats in there. So, two. There aren't any cats in that video. They're just fake cats. CGI. Do you think I was born yesterday? First of all, that was a really weird video, okay? You're trying to be strangely artsy-fartsy. And, you know... Cinema snobs like me know artsy fartsy, and we know tryhards, and you seriously are trying hard with that video, so I don't know how many cats are in there. I don't know. A, a baker's dozen, maybe. I don't know. I mean, wh wh what am I supposed to do? Sit there and count? I have other things to do. I have movies to watch. Yeah! Shimmy, shimmy up! Ears moving. Backwards. This is backwards. This is reverse, okay? 
down. Is this backwards? I think I'm, is this right? Backwards. Okay. that her ass really itches, but she doesn't dare scratch it on camera. But it really itches! Right, I, I had to go back over the footage and write down everything that I said backwards to be able to do this, so I hope that you appreciate all the hard work I put in. Right. Tun Regnig Nifilip A Ekil No Itit Et Mok Et Hukrunurk Li Tuk Final Et Ekam anog esua et ni srot doho good et. I've done this before. I know how to do this one. Cold fill thou when, warm blood thy sea, and old art thou when, made new be too. Were this fine, succession by beauty his proving, excuse old my and make and count my sum shall. Mine old fair child, fair this answer couldst thou fair thou use beauty's thy deserved praise. More much howl, praise thriftless and shame eaten all, and were I sunken deep on thine within, say too. Days lusty thy of treasure all the where all lies beauty thy all where us being then now on gaze so livery proud use thy be field beauty in thy trenches deep in dig thy brow besiege shall winters forty when it's hard with that I know I'll have a go at doing it right handed this is not going to be pretty I don't think wish. Wish me luck. That's not too bad, actually. Backwards. Well, backwards would be proper backwards of oh. It's, uh, it's backwards, very backwards. Oh, it's all fine though. It's all fine. Oh, <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
عايز اشرب هو trying to do crap like this. You know, how do you come up with this kind of talent show? Well, there's no more questions, and you're the winner! How do you feel? Oh. Well, well, you put a boy in your world. Lost for words for once. Oh. Told you. I told you, laddie. I told you, laddie. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's, that's, oh, fucking right. Oh, she probably shouldn't swear. Oh, pardon. Oh, the wife will be happy when she gets home, won't she? Oh, yes, yeah, she will. Oh, yes, yeah, she will. Yeah, I knew I could do it. I knew it. I could overcome the, the, the draw to the biscuits. <laughs> yes, yes. I feel... I feel like you have made very wise decision today, Mr. Agent. Very wise. Oh, thank you very much. Of course, I, I already knew that um, um, I'm going to win. So I'm really excited. I'm very excited indeed because I'm the winner. I am the winner of the competition. I'm the Talent Search UK winner. And it's me, yes, Tony the Beat Poet Clown. I am the winner. Thank you very much. I thought I would be because... I've got the ears, you know, I've got the ears, I've got the beat poetry, I've got the comedic talents. I thought I'd win, I'm the motherfucking winner. I won! Oh, I knew it. You can just tell that I'm star quality. Is there a tiara? Can I get a tiara? I guess I feel vindicated, you know? People have always avoided me, I've never had a boyfriend, and now it seems like I might have a future as a social media influencer. Well, I feel quite nice, actually. Um, I did tell you when I joined up that um, I am the heaviest of metal gods to have ever roamed the planet, but um, it feels quite nice that you can validate that for me. Oh, I've won! Oh, I've won! Karen! Karen, I've won a shave, Karen! Well, like, if you, know, if you told me I was the winner and you said, oh, congratulations, you've won, I'd be like, I know. I, I, I knew this was coming. This is no surprise to me. I was expecting this. I, I had this predicted. I, I am the most talented, as I have said for you many times in my video auditions here, that I am the most talented. And if you don't have me as the winner, I f you done fucked up. But it sounds like if you're wanting me to act like I did win, I, as I said, I'd be like, oh, well, thank you. Thank you, I won. I knew this was coming. I knew this was totally expected, and I'm ready for my mystery prize. And it better be something movie-related. If it's a fucking washer and dryer, you can keep it. Fucking keep it, or give it to me, and I'll try and sell it to buy something I want, like more movies. I, I can't believe I've won. Really? I've won, I've won, I've won, I've won. What have I won? What have I won? What'd you say? I'm the winner? Oh, are you serious? I won! Ah! I won! I won! I won! <laughs> Actually, that was a test in itself! Just to see how you react! <laughs> well, you can't do that now. I... I, uh... This is... That's not how game shows work. This isn't punked by Ashton Kutcher now, is it? 
well, I know that I'm going to win anyway. So I guess it's just good to get some practice. Huh? This test, it seemed unnecessary. You know, you've, you've brought me closer to the battle today. The biscuit battle. Well, let's carry on then. Make me a sandwich? I'm not making any sandwiches. First of all, I don't cook. I have people that cook for me. I'm one of those kind of, well, my parents do, but I'm one of those kind of people, though, that, you know, people wait on me hand and foot. I, I am a talent. Talents do not make sandwiches. Talents have someone make them sandwiches for them. Ha talents have someone bring them sandwiches, deliver them sandwiches. You know what I mean? Th you know, that's how it works when you're really talented like me. People want to kiss your ass. They make you food. They get what you what you want. You don't have to make your own goddamn sandwiches. Make yourself a sandwich, you sexist twit. At the end of the day, we're all equal. Some more than others. Making a sandwich. Um, yeah. Yeah, sure. After what you just did to me. Fuck off. Oh, all right, fine. These are my two wives. Look, I'm a man witch. <laughs> Karen! Karen, I need a sandwich, Karen! Quick, quick, give me a sandwich! I don't throw it! One of Grayson's specialties coming up. Let's be sensible and move the book out of the way. All right. I I got a special treat for you here. Yeah, this is something we used to get into rehab. Yeah. I I mean. Like, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have it now, but let me just fix it up for you. We call it a creamy breader. You want me to make you a sandwich? Okay. Just wait on the feckin' eggs now. Shouldn't use the word feckin'. It's Irish. Now, as you get, uh, like, being from the land of batter, it's, uh... Oh, eggs nearly done. Lovely jublet. Look at that. Gone all beige. Come on, lovely. Let's have you. Right, two and a half. Fucking say, boiling eggs. Look at that, boiling eggs. Lovely little bit of boiling eggs, like in it. Pour it down the sink. Not the eggs, of course. Not water. Give them a little bit of a cool down with a cool cold water. Bit of bread. Take a, take a sandwich. Do you like cheese? Is it? Bit of cheese, really. I'm done like a cheese sandwich. Don't mind a bit of blood on there, do you? Adds flavour. One lovely sandwich, but And last bit of making the sandwich. Well, here we go. We've got the eggs on, eggs on bread. Personally, not a fan of usual. I like crust. I like it nice and crusty. And just with a little smidgen of butter. Nice, gentle spread. I have considered whether my voice would be suitable for cooking videos but some would say I have a, a limited palate and I, I mean it's the wrong but I'm here to showcase what I can do 
There we go. And I personally, I'm a triangles man. There you go, rice and special. Now this, this is the creamy bread. Yeah, we used to, we used to get this in rehab. And here we go. Look, look inside. Yeah, yeah, we got, we got biscuits smuggled to us inside. You know, it's hard to break that temptation. But that's for you. I had to improvise because I have no bread in the house. So I've made a cup of tea. Does that count? Do I get extra points for making a cup of tea? Okay, there's actually liquid in here, you can hear this. Okay, for you I make classic. This is PB and J, my favorite. Um, I'm afraid it's, uh, I didn't really have any sandwich spread, so, um, it's, uh, it's got cat food in it, but it's, it's chicken, should be okay. Now, eat the sandwich. Uh, yeah. Yum! I'm not here to eat a bloody sandwich. I'm here to play music. And unless you're gonna get me to play another song, I suggest you stop fucking about. <laughs> Sandwich. Sat down now, got my camera all set, I've got my sandwich, look at that. Lovely. Right. Bread's mouldy. The secret is that I toast the bread a little bit before. Mm. All right. I do like myself a little bracing. PB and J. Fun to say, fun to eat. I didn't look. I had to peel crusts off. It's the worst there. You know, most where the bread's thickest. Go oh, gross. It's found an air in it as well. It makes the uh, mouth very dry. It's not going well. Eggs all out though. I undercooked the eggs as well. Oh, eat 
the sandwich if you insist. Delicious. Yummy. Nah, I can't eat that. Nah. Nah, I can't eat it. I mean, I, I want to, don't get me wrong, but... Oh, I swear to God, you're bringing me so close to the barrel. And we finally come to the end. And your winner is... Do we know how to Everyone, I mean like everyone, you know what I mean? Like, I, it feels a bit hollow. I win every day, you know, I win every day because I, I say no, I say no to you. You ain't got the power over me, custard cream. Huh? Or? But everyone, everyone, Oh my god, everyone, everyone! <laughs> Mystery prize is death? You think death can scare me? Me? Oh, 
This is some bullshit. You're telling me that everyone won? Everyone that entered this stupid fucking contest for this stupid dumb ass show, you're telling me that everyone wins a prize and the prize is death? Okay, this is some total bullshit. I, I knew I should have fucking known all along that this was a scam, and I kind of felt like it because the questions were stupid, everything that you're asking is stupid, your video is try hardish you're trying way too fucking hard to be hip and cool, and stupid things about making sandwiches and stupid questions and dumb bullshit, so you shammed me. You fucking shammed me, and you wasted my precious time. You know how much stuff I have to watch? You know how much stuff I have to do? People wait for me and my knowledge and my recommend fucking dations and I waste my time doing your dumb ass fucking stupid audition for a stupid fucking show which probably nobody will fucking watch. No one's gonna watch your fucking garbage show, you fucking moronic assholes. Absolute ridiculous. Thank <laughs> you. 